how do I find models? I'm having a hard try. I'm having a hard time finding models. How do I find models? Where do I look at? What websites do you go on? How do you get your models? Um, you know, how do I talk to models? How do I get models to do photo shoots with me? Well, you're in luck. I know this is probably overdue, but I've been getting it so much. I felt that I wanted, I felt that I needed to address it today. So I am going to first, the first thing we need to do is find models. I'm going to get right into this. I'm not going to waste any time. Okay. Okay. The first thing we need to do is find models. And then when you find these models, how do you message them? And how do you ask them to do photo shoots with you? Now, disclosure a lot you have to your your work speaks to you models are going to start wanting to shoot with you this is more for the people who don't have like an established portfolio who is an up-and-coming photographer somebody who wants to further their career and further their passion of photography but you need to get out there and get these models and um and shoot with these models this is going to be for you also just to show you and tell you what worked for me all right so the first thing let's dive into it First thing is let's find these models. Now there was sites for models like Model Mayhem, um, Caver, and a lot of Carver. I don't know how you saw it. Not a lot of other um, websites that we used to use back in the day to help find models. But the growth of social media, everybody is trying to get their niche out there. Everybody's trying to get what they do so great out there for the world to see. And there's no more, there's not a better powerful tool than social media right now. That's just the way it is. So the same way you post your work as a photographer, it's the same way models post their work as a model to show what they can do to get clients, to get companies after them. They have to post their work the same way. So with that being said, the best way honestly to find models is social media. So let's tell you what I did. So I need to find models. The first thing is, is to join local Facebook groups. Okay. A lot of models and a lot of photographers are on there trying to find photographers to shoot with models or photographers are trying to find models to shoot with. So how do you find these Facebook groups? Well, if you go to Facebook and then you go to your search and you just type, there's three things that you can type in. The first thing is you can just type in, you know, local models or something like that some things might come up but you need to be a little bit more specific so what i do or what we have our facebook groups around here if you type in the area code of the location that you're in so here we type in you know 757 models and photographers or 757 models or something like that um a lot of those things will come up to show you what local facebook groups you have to you know reach out to them and see who's on there and see who's posting so that's the first thing you can do the next thing you can do is search by your local city or your state so like norfolk or virginia beach models or virginia models or whatever the case may be all those things you will be able to find uh local models and local photographers in your area to basically shoot with and then you can reach out to them Belonging to those groups is really, really beneficial. When there's local things going on, there's a great way to interact and reach out to a lot of those models. You can find local events going on in your area um, and see who's putting on stuff like that. So definitely Facebook groups is like really, really great. So that brings us to my next way to find models and that is Instagram. Now in Instagram, the best way to actually find them is using hashtags, all right? The way this works is if you go up to Instagram and you use the hashtag the same way you would kind of search in Facebook. If you put like, you know, like my area code is 757. So 757 models or VA models like VA for Virginia or Virginia Beach models or anything like that. Models in your area who use those hashtags will pop up for you. So if you search those tags, it's going to come up with a lot of models or anybody who's used those tags. So if you're a local models or anybody who calls themselves a model and they use those tags, they will show up and then you can reach out to those models that way. And that is really, really great because it brings up a lot of pages on people in your area who you probably have not connected with or you don't know that they are models or modeling. So that is a great way to find models through Instagram. 
use the hashtags, find out who's using those hashtags and reach out to them, all right? Now that we found our models, what do you do? How do you contact them? How do you reach out to them? Again, disclaimer, this is not for us who have been in this game for a long time, but this still may work for you. And I'm going to, I'm going to come off the top of the dome with this one. I kind of know what I, what I'm going to say, but. Oh, hell no. I'm going to come off the top of the dome. So if you're reaching out to a model, so once you find these models, you have to be humble. OK, don't come off to a model as if you know everything, like you've been in the game for a while and everything, because what happens is when you say who you are, the first thing they're going to do is go to your page and check your work. And if you don't have the work and if you don't have if your work does not look like what you're saying, they models are going to know that. You know what I'm saying? So you want to be humble. So. If I find a model and I'm a new photographer, up and coming photographer, I'm going to send a model something like this. Now, now follow me, flow with me here. Hey, how you doing? My name is Brandon Cole. I am local and I am an up and coming photographer. I have an amazing passion for photography and currently I'm looking for a few local models in the area to help me um, in order to bring my passion to life. I came across your page. You have some amazing pictures and I would love to work with you. If you could spare me about 30 minutes to an hour of your time to get some amazing shots of you, I don't mind giving you the pictures after the photo shoot um, and it would be great and maybe we can establish um, a long lasting business relationship and this will be great for your portfolio and it would also be great for mine. Um, I would love to hear back from you. Um, please don't hesitate to reach out. Let me know what your availability is and uh, we can go from there. Thank you and you have a blessed day. Yeah. Yeah. Hey, that's pretty good. All right. So I would basically take that blurbage or verbiage and you can manipulate it however you want to. But when you say something like that, as that establishes a few things that establishes the respect that is that, that establishes that this is a business relationship that is also establishes that you don't know everything, you know, but you're humble and you would love to work with them. And basically what happens is a lot of times when models see that and you're 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 truthful and you're humble like that, they'll reach out for you and say, oh, thank you. I really appreciate it. Well, you know what? I got about 30 minutes or so on this day. I, I, I wouldn't mind coming out working with you, something like that. Sometimes they might not respond at all. And that's OK. The trick is to get that verbiage perfect and then copy it and paste it to a lot of other models. And nine times out of 10, you're going to get about three or four people out about 20 or so, whatever, or 15. I don't know what the numbers are. It depends on your area. Um, but you're going to get some people that's going to respond back and say, like, hey, I really appreciate that. Thank you. Blah, 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 blah. But it's all about your delivery. You know, it's all about how you reach out to them. And that's how you get models. And then after a while, once you get out there and you're practicing and you, you're getting these images and stuff like that, you're going to get better. And you're going to get better and you're going to get better and soon your page your portfolio is going to be amazing and then guess what they're going to start reaching out to you and saying hey i was looking for a photographer in your area you have some amazing work your portfolio is amazing i would love to shoot with you what are your rates do you do tfp or whatever the case may be but that's how you get established and it takes time you know you cannot be afraid of the grind all right it's a lot, a lot of photographers just want it now and they want it now. I want to know. I want it now. I want to know how to do it now. We've grind this thing out for years and years and years to establish the the knowledge and the know how in this game. And I just I, it really hurts me when I see so many people just like now, now, now I want to know how to edit now. I want to know how to do this now. There is no grind to it. Don't be afraid of the grind, guys. But this is how I started off getting those models, getting that verbiage down, reaching out to models, being humble. And after a while, it just took off. And then I got better and better and better. And then after a while, I started getting clients. I started getting agencies. I started getting a lot of different people who wants me to shoot because my portfolio now reflects it. And it's all about your work. You got to just let your and after a while, your work is going to speak for itself. Regardless of what nobody else says, let your work speak for you. Don't worry about what people say. You let your work speak for you. 
all right hopefully that helps you guys out man this is your boy brandon and i'm going to be back i really like these vlogs now this, this is awesome so um comment down below man what worked for you if this video helped you out man and um i will see you guys in another video because we're going to start dropping these so much more I, i'm really liking this this is absolutely this is amazing